When I began teaching 40 years ago, everybody went into your classroom and you closed your door. There was no support system at all. I mean, you floundered. And, and I, I hate to think of what I did to kids those first few years because I was floundering. Uh, but now it's just, it is just remarkable what, what, we, what we give to each other, not just young teachers, but, but what we give to everybody. And again, you know, at 40 years, I need support too. And, and I have it. Uh, I have it through the coma uh, and because we are, we're all in it together. And, and coma has actually brought that to us. It was there on a subconscious level, but now it's a conscious, a conscious thing and it happens all the time. And I think that when we saw the pathways, when that became so obvious, you know, you know it. But when it's thrown out there in front of you, when those pathways of those, the needs of the children was put before us last year, I have seen the biggest empathy, and I don't mean sympathy, but empathy for children. I have seen teachers addressing so many more needs than just academics. I've seen teachers in my building addressing all the pathways. And that wasn't there before this year. And when you address all the pathways, of course, you're going to see more academic success. And I think that's going to make a big difference. But I think if any, besides the collaboration, just making us aware of the pathways. Teachers that you probably, you, you know they were good teachers, but they just were not assertive. Now when you, when you have, te we have team planning every other, every two weeks now. And those teachers are becoming leaders. Those teachers are sharing. Um, you walk down the hall in my school in the afternoon and you will see teachers working together, talking about their day. Well, this worked or this didn't work. I never saw this before this year to this extent. But I think just giving teachers, again, ownership has made, um, made them more assertive, made them um, the no fault has been letting us know that it's okay to take a risk. It's okay to fall because nobody's going to blame you. Uh, I've seen a lot in our school system also, or our school also, of bottoms up, I, I think that's the term that I want to use. Uh, we're making more and more decisions with the principal's permission and input, but we're getting to make more and more decisions with this program. And I think the collaboration has allowed us to, to feel like we knew what we were talking about and gave us the, the feeling that we could do that and make decisions that would be good for kids. And, and of course it takes pressure off the principal too because she's, she's one person and when she's getting um, input from a whole staff and it's quality input. And again, I don't think we, I know we didn't do that, but we've, we feel like we can do that now because we have so many areas that, that we collaborate in. Sometimes when you're a veteran teacher, you, you step back. And this year I feel like um, I've been able to use my, some expertise uh, not that it wasn't, not that I couldn't have before, but uh, I feel like I've been able to use it. I feel like it will keep teachers in the classroom longer. I really do because if I, and there are, there's not a day goes by that I couldn't use help. And there's not a staff person in my, in my hall in fourth grade, we're all in the same hall, that I could not go to and get help. I went, bef right before I came, I went and asked a question to a, a teacher who's been teaching like 11 years. I, I had a question, I went and, and I asked her opinion. And of course, she readily gave it. But it will keep teachers in the classroom longer. I don't think you'll see early retirement. I did early retire and came back when I was offered some, I was offered the job at Charles England, and I had heard so many great things about Charles England. Uh, but I think it will keep teachers in the classroom longer, as well as the recruit new teachers. Teaching is now fun. This year has been I've had the most fun this year of my 40 years, and it's it's all the. I, I just feel a part of the team. I think everybody feels a part of the team. And it's just, you just have, it's one big happy team.